Are the Olympics bad for your health? In June, the global insurance company Pacific Prime listed the five riskiest sports of the London 2012 Olympic Games. Included in the list were the pole vault. Between 2003 and 2009, 19 pole vaulters experienced catastrophic injuries to the head, spine, and other parts of the body. Gymnastics, long recognized as a hotbed of physical and mental stress. Cycling, not so good apparently for the back and knees, even if you do stay on the bike while hurtling along at over 40 miles per hour. Equestrian events, some studies have suggested horse riding carries more risks than riding a motorcycle. And finally, boxing, no surprises there. The American Association of Neurological Surgeons report that 90% of professional level boxers sustain some form of brain injury. But while Olympic sports may look dangerous to an outsider, a recent story in the San Francisco Chronicle suggests airplane illness and long-haul travel are bigger concerns for the US team's medics than any sporting injuries. So while pole vaulting, cycling or boxing may look risky, it's who you sit next to on the flight that Olympians should really be worried about. Risk Bites, a different take on the science of risk, coming November 2012.